Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I have got a B&M haul for you and I thought it would be nice if I shared what I got and maybe if you see anything you like then you can pop into B&M and you could pick it up for yourself. If you do like what you see then please hit that subscribe button and give this video a like and yeah let's get into it. So the first item I've got to show you is this lovely lantern and it's got the candle already in there so all I have to do is put a battery in and this was 6.99. But yeah, it's just like shabby chic style and I really like that sort of style. So yeah, I picked that up. So I'm looking forward to seeing what that looks like on my fireplace or wherever I decide to put it. I have a room diffuser. It's a lovely glass, silvery, glittery holder there. And it's got the diffusers further up there, obviously. This one is the frozen berries and it was 3 99 And yeah, the packaging is really nice as well. Okie dokie, next up we have this multi-purpose caddy and I'm going to use this to put my makeup in. At the moment it's just in a makeup bag and a little storage tray so I thought that this would be quite good to have it a bit more organised. And that was one ninety nine. It's just plastic and it's got eight compartments. So yeah, it's just perfect for, you know, lipstick, mascaras, foundation, that sort of thing. So that should tidy my little makeup area up a little bit. Then I bought some ballpoint pens because I'm forever losing pens, as I'm sure most families are that have got kids that like to draw and write and things. So there's 10 in there and they were £1.49, which I thought was quite, quite cheap for 10 pens. And next I got some fry light. I got the olive oil flavour. I believe that was £1.49. So trying to be a bit more healthier really, try not to use too many fattening things so I just bought that. Next are my favourite crisps, these were 99p and you get six in a pack so that's just the salt and vinegar squares and I got some skips for the kids and there is six in there and they were again 99p. I got some Weetabix I think they were £2.20 for 36 which is quite good. Ellie's into Weetabix at the minute so I bought them for her. I got some ibuprofen because we've run out and I think they were about 25p or something and you get 16 in there so it's always good just to stock up on those isn't it. My girls absolutely love these Barney Bears and again these were 99p and you get in there so yep yeah, they normally have the strawberry ones but they didn't have any strawberry so we've gone for the chocolate ones I got these colour sheets for the washing machine so that I can um, you know mix the colours I don't just have to have darks whites and everything like that I just find it a lot easier and quicker to just bung a load in at the same time so yeah they were a pound and you get 30 sheets in there so that's really good I've already got some but it's always good just to stock up on a few more and the fad at the moment that everybody seems to be into is Zaflora. I've already got a few bottles but I thought I would pick some more because this was 99p and I got the lavender one. Next up I bought some bedding for Sophie's little hamster that was 79p. Not too much you can say about hamster bedding really. <coughs> I got another one of these, just handy to have in the house in case I need it. Now for Ellie's nursery, I've got two pictures. These were one ninety nine each and the first one is like that. Her room is grey and pink so this is ideal because it's grey and pink and white and it just says dream big little one. So that's the first one and the second one is very similar but it just says good night on there with some stars and things again in the pink and the white so yeah we've got some hooks already in her room so I'll put them up this afternoon when she wakes up from her nap I have bought a random mug tree and this was 2 99 I got some comfort, this was on offer, I think it was a pound off, can't remember exactly how much it was but it was about £2.50 I think 
and it's the cherry blossom and sweet pea and it smells really 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 nice so yep yeah, got that and i've got this to try for the first time it's um Dettol laundry cleanser i've got the sensitive one and you get 20 washes in there and it kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria and i got some of the mateys which are the cheap version of Lucky Charms. My kids love these and I love them, but they are quite sugary, so they only have them every now and then. It's not something they'd have every day. But yeah, as a treat, then I've got those. They were 99p, I believe. So I've got some of those. I got some Candorel instead of normal sugar on my Weetabix in the morning. And that was, I don't know how much that was. Not very expensive anyway. So I've got that. I've got a new frying pan. This is a Russell Hobbs one and it was 7 99 And it's a non-stick one and it's white and black. I thought that was quite cute so I bought that. Because the one I've got apparently is non-stick but it actually does stick everything in its pants basically. I bought this for my living room. It was 9 99 but it was in the sale for 4 99 it's just a white jug with some white artificial flowers in it with some green foliage and things. I thought that was very cute. I needed some light bulbs for my lamp that I have in the living room. So I bought those. They were 2 99 and you get two in a pack. I got some of these cheesy breadsticks for Ellie. They were 99p. I got two of those packs and she's already started to demolish one of them. So they're a hit. And finally, I just bought some baby wipes. And yeah, that's pretty much everything that I bought. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and let me know what your favourite item was. And thanks for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and I will see you in my next haul. Bye bye.